Loma 1 was pavocyclib with aromatase inhibitor in first-line metastatic patients, so what you would consider to be an endocrine-sensitive population. So what we learned today with Paloma 3, Paloma 3 was a endocrine-resistant population, so these are patients who had already progressed on aromatase inhibitor therapy, and they were randomized to either fulvestrin alone or fulvestrin in combination with pavocyclib. Importantly, also in this study, patients who were both pre- and postmenopausal were allowed, patients who were premenopausal were given gucelerin, and then patients who were postmenopausal were given the fulvestrin. And what we learned in this study is that there was a significant advantage to the addition of pavocyclib to fulvestrin, similar to what we had seen in Paloma 1. So now in a more endocrine refractory patient population, there was a six-month improvement in progression-free survival with the addition of the pavocyclib compared to fulvestrin alone. The fulvestrin alone PFS was about three months, it was about nine months with the pavocyclib and the fulvestrin. So a six-month improvement there. Now, as far as toxicity, there was toxicity as we would expect with palbocyclib, namely in the form of myelosuppression with neutropenia. Very high rates of neutropenia compared to fulvestrin alone, which basically does not have neutropenia at all. However, importantly, very low rates of treatment discontinuation, irrespective of treatment arm, and low rates of febrile neutropenia. So something that you're seeing, but is not necessarily clinically significant as far as the toxicity. So as far as Paloma 3, a number of important take-home points. Number one, to see activity beyond the first-line setting with palbocyclib, to see activity with fulvestrin in addition to an aromatase inhibitor as was seen in Paloma 1, to see activity in patients who are premenopausal in addition to patients who are postmenopausal, and to, to have more data to support the use of palbocyclib in endocrine-positive metastatic patients.